Hey everybody, Jerb here. Uh, I'm going to do something slightly different for these next handful of videos. And that's uh, going over some old characters. We only have, what, a week and a couple days, maybe a week left of the game before it completely shuts down. So, instead of doing a how to build, I was thinking I'd go through a bunch of the original girls that haven't been fixed or updated or anything since the game came out. And go over things that I would do to update them and change them had the game kept going and the devs would like to, you know, continue doing it. But they're shutting it down. I just thought this is an interesting thought experiment. So here's the skills. Three water bombs interrupts enemies' actions. Really doesn't effectively do that. The shoots will, the, mo the watch out from above skill could be good. But there's a huge delay. And by the time you fire, everyone's already left the area. So let's go over here and check out the wedding. Yeah, oh boy, it extends the range of your shotgun triple blast. Oh boy. And then the watch out from above can deal damage immediately. There's even, it can be launched while moving and de deal damage immediately. There's still a slight de delay. I play this once pre, like, I think I play one match uh, pre-marriage and then I do the marriage just to see and there's still a, a delay just enough for people to get out from under the the blast on the ground okay so here we go all right let's uh, start loading in and see how this goes I pre-recorded the footage but I it's like a week ago sorry I intended to do a lot of these previously but yeah it is just a crap fest like these original girls even built up like I have a bunch of her stats maxed and she's weak as hell and I think most of my kills come because my I've got barrel as my support character with the poison like that huge delay for the drop that shouldn't even be the boost on it what they should have done immediately is like rework some of these characters this is the first character you play as the first one you unlock and she's just a pile of crap like her damage is meh. The shotgun blast was interesting. Granted, like that. Like, I hadn't been married and I was already moving around. But like... Oh, there I got stuck. But like that huge delay on there is so terrible. Like, when other characters, newer ones, started being created with the instant bomb drop, they should have immediately upgraded her with that. Or Akane with it as well. Because, like... These old ones, they're useless in the new matches. And, like, a majority of the kills I get aren't even from the girl. They're from the fangirl that I'm using because I've got barrel maxed. But up, it's just absurd. Like, I think the game would have done better if people coming to it would have started with someone who was useful. Like that giant delay. I mean... Personally, I think what they should have done is like the shotgun blast could have been upgraded to maybe a triple triple shot So it's like pow 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 and then have it more sporadic like not like as a trade-off you get like a Shotgun blast of three to five at a time and not just have it like that like Didn't do crap for damage there and I've noticed even hitting people doesn't eliminate their ability to stagger it doesn't eliminate their ability to move it doesn't like she should have a stun immediately on one of them like the above drop should probably do instantaneous damage a small dot or like a three second stun and then the shotgun blast with the three shots should probably have a like a triple shot where it's like pow 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 three 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 so it's nine total and not all like the first three are set but then have the two other sets of three more randomized so they're not exactly targeting where they're gonna hit immediately they could be random so essentially like a true shotgun blast like the first three go in their predetermined pattern and then the next sets like a three and three would be more randomized but much more powerful so each one would get like increased in damage so the first one would be like you know slightly high damage then the second one would be like 50 percent more damage and then the third one would just be like a monster blast hit of a shotgun blast so it's just pow 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 three sets of three right off the bat 
then they could like like I said from the watch out from above skill they should add a damage over time like a stun like right off the bat one to three seconds stun then do a slight or for sure add a slow to it like slow patient like people down just hit them with it, slow them down, and then shotgun blast the crap out of their face. So it would be something that makes sense for a main, the primary face of the game, have her be just an all-around good, not tanky tank build, but just someone who can actually dish out damage slow and control, and then just blast the hell out of them. Like, stun slow, maybe damage over time with it, and then shotgun the crap out of them. It'd be a good all-around fix for her character, because the way she's built is, right now, she's weak as crap. The skills don't do anything. They don't slow. Like, oh boy, the the three-blast shotgun. It says it interrupts people, but, like, as you can see, not a single freaking one of them actually stop attacking every time you shoot them. Like, they just tap it again, and they keep firing. It, I, like, I don't want to say it's bugged, but it just doesn't seem to work as well as it should. But heck yeah, like, honestly, I think the devs could have added a lot of longevity by giving this game upgrades to the all the original characters. And it doesn't even need to be huge, that's why I'm doing these videos, because, like, some of them would be... I mean, granted, a couple of them definitely monster upgrades, because they were so terrible... A new player would come in, get stuck with the character, and just die repeatedly to anyone who has, like, an upgraded character. There's no way to beat some of them. Like, or hell, even, like, Akane, maybe give her her, with the shotgun blast, give her some super armor where she can blast through attacks while she's getting damaged. She doesn't, like that, or I just get stunned to death. There's no way, there's no way to survive through that. So maybe with the shotgun blast, give her a couple seconds of immunity to stun or like something around those lines because it's like consistently just dying over and over and over and barely getting kills is ridiculous like all these kills i'm getting here it's because i've got barrel as the finger so adding adding those effects to the two her two main skills would have definitely drastically improved the ability to play as her and I feel like the game could have lasted easily a few more years had the devs gone through this. I mean, granted, maybe they just didn't care because they really haven't done shit for, what, two years or something? I think Anne was the last girl, the uh, ice fangirl. Or the ice-using girl with the dancer fans. I don't know what it's called. Whatever. But anyways, yeah, it's like they needed to upgrade so many people and they didn't do crap for, what, two years. That could have hugely impacted the fan base well with that said uh i've got a whole slew of these i think i recorded eight or nine different characters already i'll try and pump out a bunch this week try and get them out before the game shuts down for good so anyways if you watched this entire thing thank you my apologies for rambling i had a much better script worked out for what i was going to say but I'm tired. It was a long work day, a long weekend. So thank you very much for watching. Much appreciated. It would be very liked if you could like, comment, or subscribe. Thank you very much. Have a great night.